Now I have this post on my Facebook page where I said it is wrong to start a snail farm with baby snails. And since this post has been dropped on my Facebook page, I've been getting so many questions from farmers complaining that why should I share such information online? And some persons we are appreciating the post, but this is the the reason behind the post now if you're starting a snail farm it is very wrong to start off with baby snails very wrong now the reason is simple you're going you are going to get discouraged before you before you how do i put this now you're going to get discourage on time because first you are a newbie and babies are fragile you need to understand how to rest nails to be able to care for the babies right so starting off with the babies is going to give you tough time yes it's going to give you a lot of challenges and apart from the challenges that will come with it it's going to take you a longer time before you start really actually enjoying what snow farming is all about now if you are not following us on facebook please do follow us on our facebook page is raw vision snow farm no there are some quote there are some write-ups you can get here or you'll get them on the page so if you're not following kindly follow the page right away for back-to-back -back updates about snail farming. Now, if you're starting off with the breeders, the point of lay is better. Alright? It's better because at the point you're starting off with the breeders, they're already coming into your farm with eggs. You understand? They're coming into your farm prepared to unleash the egg there. They, they, they carry it and so almost the same month you start seeing babies because an egg is going to be incubated for 21 days to hatch into baby and so for this 21 days you already start seeing babies and seeing the babies gives you this motivation to do more gives you this motivation to actually enjoy farming snails and in this process you get to quickly learn how to incubate because incubation is not just about digging the eggs into the soil or covering the eggs with sand right so you need to understand how this is done now if you don't know how to incubate snail eggs i have an ebook that teaches you how to incubate egg for hashability you can get a copy of that i'll be dropping the link to that in the description of this video as well now if you start off with point of lay now they are going to be coming to your farm more of a version that is to say they are going to start laying all their eggs in your farm all right now the point of lay are not already laying snails these are snails mature right for for egg production so they are coming to your farm to give you the pullet the first set of eggs this means that they are going to lay every egg in the laying season in your farm okay so it is better to get the point of lay or the breeders to start off your farm now if you must get babies please do not get hatchlings do not get hatchlings you can get growers right from three to four months old snails right now this grass shouldn't be your only stock get the grass alongside with your point of lay the strategy is simple as your point of lay are giving you babies giving you eggs you're turning these eggs into babies the growers are growing into point of lay all right so by the time they are giving you ba uh, babies they're giving you eggs giving you babies you're raising your babies the growers are also growing into point of lay. So 
it's easy for you to have a return because when your babies are getting closer to a point of like getting closer to eight nine months the growers you already got are already above nine months which means they're already laying again so you have two uh two generations laying for you two foundations giving you babies at the same time so your snail farm can strive but please do not start your snail farm with babies it is better to start off with point of lace or breeders i see some persons also make mistake getting jumbos to start your snail farm with this mindset of the jumbos are big so the babies are going to be big no these jumbos are close to menopause they're not going to give you eggs for a long period of time all right most farmers will sell them off because they want to clear their farm it is better to sell that to those that are consuming than selling it to somebody that is about starting off a new farm so it's wrong to get babies to start it is also wrong to start off with jumbo sizes of snails i'll see you in the next video please like share and tag somebody that will need this information peace Rovigil Snail Farm with Kes.